Hi everyone. Thank you for joining me for a high level overview of Acumatica presented by The Answer Company. Let's start by logging into Acumatica. Anywhere you have access to the internet, you will have access to Acumatica. This includes using your desktop or laptop, tablet and smartphone. Once you're connected to the internet and logged into Acumatica, you'll be able to quickly get to the critical business data you need. Acumatica is a rule-based system. Configurable permissions can be set up so that each user within the software will only have access to the different screens, fields, and transactions that they need to do their job. Now let's cover navigation. Here on the left-hand side of the screen, we have a set of tools that are called Acumatica workspaces. And each one of these workspaces is configured around a different business process area. For example, an accounts payable clerk would have a workspace dedicated to doing things like entering new vendor bills, running different reports, such as a vendor summary or an AP aging report, and also have the ability to manage vendor profiles. Similarly, an accounts receivable workspace will have the inverse set of tools and be suited to manage AR invoices, run AR reports, etc. These workspaces are designed to help each user be more efficient in their operations due to Acumatica's ability to organize the different screens and links that they might be looking for in an easy to access way. However, you can always use the universal search function to navigate through Acumatica as well. For example, if I type in the term sales order in the search bar on the top left of the screen, Acumatica will return every area in the system that I might be looking for. I can run any of these tasks from this menu, like a new sales order, or perhaps work on my sales order preferences. The search functionality also allows us to search across the knowledge base if I need help on a specific topic. I can search upon the document management repository if anything has been uploaded, and I can also search across transactions and profiles. This is useful if let's say I have a customer on the phone that is looking for the status of an invoice, then I can type in that invoice number to quickly locate it in the system. Dashboards are another defining aspect of Acumatica. Each user will have a dashboard that is configured to the role in the organization. For example, a controller will have a dashboard that is very much focused on the financials of the business such as what customers do I have on credit hold? Who do we have in our overdue aging account? And what are our top overdue balances? These dashboards are designed around actionable insights. So not only do you get this analytical information in a snapshot of your business, but you can also drill into the details. Then you can start taking action on the different items that need your attention. Acumatica dashboards are simple to personalize. You can drag and drop items. You can delete items that you don't deem appropriate for your dashboard, or you can add new widgets by simply choosing from options like trend cards, Power BI tiles, embedded pages, data tables, and charts of many types. To summarize our overview today, Acumatica is a role-based ERP system that provides streamlined operations for its users. This adaptable cloud solution allows you to connect from anywhere with internet access, including a mobile device with the mobile app. Gain access to real-time inventory and analytics. Easily create dimensional reporting using sub-accounts and grouping. And even give your customers access to a self-service portal where they can place their own orders and review their documents and statements. We hope you enjoyed this short presentation on Acumatica. For more information on this or any other Acumatica topic, please contact The Answer Company.